President's Chief of Staff Femi Bajabiamila has revealed that a provisional wage increase President Bolatin will announce for all low-grade workers for six months will cut across all workers. This followed a four-hour meeting between leaders of the organized labor and representatives of the federal government held at the Asurok Presidential Villa. He expressed optimism that the labor unions will backtrack on the nationwide strike planned for Tuesday. Labor had rejected President Bolatinbo's 25,000 naira provisional wage increment for low-grade workers. It also rejected the government's proposed six-month period for the provisional increase covers. Rather, it should run until a new minimum wage is approved. The unions also insisted that the wage increase be reviewed upwards to 35,000 naira. You see labor and government side. We will, hopefully, we expect that uh, labor will call a meeting of their uh, various branches and executive tomorrow to 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 to, to present the uh, the agreements uh, that have been reached, and we pray and we believe and we hope that the strike will be called off on Tuesday. Um, Twitter um, there was a lot of chatter on Twitter about the issue of um, low um, income workers only falling into the category of the wage bill, and. Um, they, they supported that, and um, that has been, we, we, we did communicate with Mr. President, and he quickly um, did say and agree that, uh, um, that all categories of workers will be given uh, uh, the wage bill. There's nothing like um, low income, mid income, or high income. It's very important for us to underscore something. Labor and government are not adversaries. Labor and government are working at least moving forward in partnership for the good of the common man. That's important to underscore. Thank you very much. What uh, the chief of staff have said, we have been meeting, you know, we have looked at almost all the issues, all the promissory notes, you know, from the government. And we looked at how to translate them to reality, you know, and uh, to be workable. And then uh, we're going to take those promises to our organs. Of course, you know these people here cannot just wake up and uh, review and call off action. So, like you said, we're hopeful that uh, our organs will have a look at them and give us a fresh mandate on what needs to do. Let me, on behalf of the TUC, also point out to the fact that we've had a series of conversations surrounding the issue raised and uh, we do hope that uh, by tomorrow we are going to get across to our organs so that we can also look at it and cross fertilize ideas and see the way forward. I'm sure we are coming. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.